Get her on! Don't worry, I know parkour. What an asshole! So, should we talk about the elephant in the room here? I didn't want to bring it up because I didn't think anyone else could see it. What? I'm, I'm talking about your schizophrenia diagnosis. Right, yeah, that, that makes more sense, actually. What do you keep looking at? Uh, nothing, it's nothing, don't worry about it. It's a bird! It's a plane! No, I, I think it's definitely a bird. <coughs> Are you okay, man? I don't know, fellas, I, I think I might be kind of stupid. Finally done the dishes! <coughs> you motherfucker! Bitch! Motherfucker! Fucking bitch! Bitch! Motherfucker! Shitty bitch! Mom, can I get a TV? No. Can I get a laptop? No. Can I get an Xbox? No. What about a PlayStation? No! How about a pizza for dinner tonight? What? Do you think I'm made of money or something? Well, what do you think Mom stands for? Just stop talk- Wake up, filthy. Do you want to form an alliance with me? Absolutely, I do. Good. Good. Excellent. Hey, Dad, uh, Mom just texted me something. What did she say? Tell your dad to clean the house, do the laundry, and get dinner ready before she comes back from shopping. <laughs> well, tell your mother, yesterday I did it, and today is her turn. Yeah, but I would have thought you guys would have, you know ordered in or something why why today because it's your anniversary happy anniversary by the way oh you didn't wish her oh she's mad mad i'll start with the laundry you start with the food thank you we're almost done giving names to all the chess pieces all we have left is this horse looking one We've been doing this for hours, man. I want to go to bed. Can't we just call it a night? I like it. That's a straightforward piece name. I thought the straightforward piece name was the Rook. Ah. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Maybe the next one will be better. Oh, this is very bad. Hey, man, what you doing? I'm just shooting a video for school. Oh, I guess I'll start shooting too. That's totally fine with me. Are you gay? No. Do your mama know you gay? <laughs> no. Wait. Fuck. Motherfucker. If I say no, then I'm gay. Got it. Yes. Fuck. When you and your siblings are supposed to be asleep. Yo. Beep la poop. <laughs> the baby where's the baby where is my baby have you seen the baby no i have not seen the baby when was the last time you saw the baby now get out there and find that baby if you have any information regarding the whereabouts of our baby <laughs> how could you lose the baby i never even wanted the baby our top story today police across the country are still searching for the baby the baby. There's the baby. You will need to be seated in a brace position. Brace. Oh fuck, Dave. Dad, can I throw a party? Will there be drugs at this party? You already know what you need. I got you. No drugs at the party. Right, no drugs at the party. Why would, why would I say I got you? Will there be alcohol? Well, it's a party, right? What's that mean? That there's not going to be any alcohol at this party. Are you inviting girls to the party? Yep, strippers. What? Strippers. Fully naked. I'm talking about cinnamon, candy, precious, diamond, Mercedes. No strippers at the party. All will not be here at my party. No hoes. Have this hoes. Get on the guest list. I have no idea. As long as you follow my rules, you can have your party. Yes, thank you so much. Hello? Hey Derek, it's Cinnamon. I'm with the other girls. I got the drugs and the alcohol. Imagine instead of ages, it was levels. Like I'm level 28. How cool is that? <laughs> Dude, my daughter died at level 4. <sighs> Noob. Hey kiddo, that bully that you had, we talked to him about bullying and we suspended him for three days. You ain't got to worry about that no more. 
What the fuck did you do? You stopped him from whooping my ass for three days. Bitch, you think he don't know one of the people he punched down, told on him? What the fuck gonna happen when he come back? Wait a minute. Matter of fact, bitch, don't worry about it. They make stuff for these types of situations. Tools. I've been trying to be a good fucking student, but don't worry about it, cause he coming back. And if that motherfucker breathe on me wrong, I'ma expel that bitch from life. I gave you motherfuckers a chance and you fucked me. But if he do anything else to you, we will handle it. Bitch, if he do anything else to me again, I'ma handle it. Permanently. Hello, welcome to heaven. Hello. Tell me, what was your worst scene? Um, I blew bubbles. What? That's not a scene, you can come inside. Next. Hi. What was your worst scene? I also blew bubbles. Still not a scene. Come inside next. Hi, I'm Jack, but people call me Bubbles. Do you think you can make it as a waiter? What's your biggest strength? Well, I like to think I can bring a lot to the table. <laughs> oh, okay, a joker, okay. I like this guy, put it there. You're hired. Now on to my weaknesses. Hi, excuse me, um, do you sell bouquets for children? You're not a paedophile though, right? What? No, they're for my girlfriend. This is a kid. Hmm. Uh, girlfriend's a kid, she likes flowers, so. Two lips. I uh, Yeah, why wouldn't she? She had two eyes and her nose as well. Uh, she exists. <laughs> Well, that, that's good, uh, but I, I meant like what you want, um, like tulips, orchids, you know, oh, well, I'll take the kids. Hey mom, let me introduce you to my girlfriend. Hi, it's a pleasure to finally meet you. <sighs> I, you couldn't find anything better? Hey mom, leave her alone, alright? I love her. Shut the fuck up! I was talking to her. Hey man, you wanna eat this cake with me? Fuck it, let's do it. Whoa man, what do you mean? <laughs> yeah, fuck it, let's do it together. I don't want to do it. Then why'd you ask me to eat it with you? I just want to eat it. Fuck it. Bro, stop, man. You're scaring you me. You don't want to do it together? I'm not into you that way, bro. Whoa, whoa. What are you talking about, bro? I just want to eat the cake. I feel like we want the same thing. Why are you trying to fuck the cake? What? I want to eat the cake. You want to fuck it. No, I'm, I'm saying fuck it. Let's eat it. Can we just like eat the majority of it and then you can fuck it? The fuck? Why do you want to fuck the cake? What? I don't understand what you want. It's over. You finally caught it. Oh my... Dude, don't use that. Yeah, 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 okay, okay, okay. So you're gonna share 98% of your DNA with humans. Yo, that's lit. So we're like pretty much the same, right? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, essentially. Oh, fuck yeah. So like I'll live in a house and drive cool cars and do cool shit like that. <clears throat> Yo. Yo, God. You're gonna love bananas. Oh, come on, bananas? I'd rather eat my own shit. Yeah, that too. Hey, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> You're so cute. All right, let, let me let me try something. We're gonna play a game, came up with it, off the dome. Ah, uh, all right. Peekaboo. <laughs> Yo, Dad. All right, this ain't funny. Dad. I don't understand, we have milk, Dad. Oh, he's gone, he's gone. Peekaboo. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you like that? <laughs> All right, you got me. <laughs> All right. This guy's at a bar having some drinks. All of a sudden, he throws up all over himself. He goes, oh, my God, my wife's going to kill me. What do I do? Bartender says, tell you what, take $20, put it in your shirt pocket, tell us someone threw up on your shirt, gave you the money to clean it. Guy says, great idea. Gets in a cab, goes home. Walks in the door, the wife goes, look at you. You're drunk. You're disgusting. You threw up all over yourself. He goes, no, honey, someone threw up on me and put $20 in my shirt pocket to have it cleaned. She goes in his pocket, pulls out the money. She goes, yeah, there's two 20s in here. What's the other one for? He goes, oh, yeah. He also shit in my pants. Do you uh, need a hand taking these fairy lights down? Oh, no, it's fine. I, I put them up myself. Come on, man. Don't be too proud. Let me help you. Oh, what? It's, it's so sticky for. Yeah. <laughs> it smells of shit. Yeah. Ugh. Like I said, I put them up myself. <laughs> if I had a nickel for every time I got confused, I'd be like, where'd this nickel come from? And then there'd be another nickel, and I'd think, what's with the nickels? Leading to more nickels and confusion. And eventually, I'd be slowly crushed by nickels, without ever knowing why.
Timmy's dad put his hands on me. What do you mean? He grabbed me. He grabbed you? He grabbed me. Why'd he grab you? Because I pushed Timmy. So he put his hands on you? Fuck that. You're a grown man gonna put your hands on my kids? Let's see what happens when I put my hands on my you. Dad don't play. Knock your ass out. My dad's straight up gangster. Yo, you put your hand on my kid? Yeah, he put his hands on me. You feel tough grabbing up an 11 year old? You ain't tough. What do I wanna do? You swing. What the fuck you mean? You know what the fuck I wanna do? Which one of these is Timmy's dad? Big one in the middle. Big one. That's it. With the muscle? He big as fuck. I wanna apologize for my son's actions. Tell him. From, from my understanding, he pushed. It wasn't even a push, it was more of like a he's, trick. He's actually saying it wasn't even really like a push. I would never push. Fell into him. I'm, I'm a Christian. We don't even really push people. The devil really. made me do it. Tell him the devil made me do it. One adult ticket, please. I can tell you're three sheep in a trench coat. Are you sure? Yes, look, one, two, three. You get $10 million. $10 million? I'm doing it. Just wait, there's a catch. What is it? You get $10 million, but a snail is chasing you for the rest of your life, and if it touches you, you die. Okay. The snail can't die, and its only purpose is to find you wherever you go. Are you still taking the money? Hey Siri, how long does it take a snail to walk a mile? A snail travels at a speed of 0 .03 miles per hour. So if it doesn't stop, it will take approximately 33 hours to travel one mile. How many miles is half of the Earth? Half of the Earth is 24,901 miles. And how long would it take a snail to walk that far? For a snail to walk 24,901 miles it would take 821,733 hours, which adds up to 93 years. So I'll just travel the summer hot. Oh my god, there's someone in the house. Get down. Get down. I can't get down, I'm sorry, I can't do it. What are you saying? He's gonna see us, get down. I can't get down, I'm sorry, I just can't. What are you saying? Just do it! Fine, okay, here I go. Oh my god, were those your knees popping? Yes, they're really loud, I was trying to tell- Oh my god, were those your knees? I literally heard that from downstairs, seriously. This is how teachers think bullying works in elementary school. What's up, loser? You're such a freaking loser. Hey, stop that. When you tell me that I'm a loser, it makes me feel sad inside, and it really hurts my feelings. Oh, you're right. I shouldn't have said that. Yeah, it's okay. Thank you. Wanna be friends? Yeah, sure, we can be best friends forever. I hate you! Oh! Well, next time, don't steal my Monopoly! Ariana, give James your $200 you landed on his property. No! He's in jail! I'm not gonna give money to a criminal! That's not how you... Play! Mommy? Why is brother screaming? Shut the f*** up, Sally! You don't get to talk after stealing my last railroad! I wish I was never born! Me too! You think I wanted this? <laughs> Eric, pronounce this. 1999. Jonathan? Uh, uh, 1888. Brian? 11 11 11. No. Gerald? 11-11-11. Martin? 11-11-11. Matthew? 1 to the power of 4. I'm surrounded by idiots. Mom, can you shut the fuck up? Does she wait before she beats your ass? I'm confused. Why isn't she- So, this bus crashes on an icy road, bursts into flames, and explodes, killing everyone inside. They all line up outside of heaven, and God greets them at the gate and says, Look, since you all died such a terrible, terrible way, I'm gonna grant you each one wish. Now, the lady at the very front of the line has always been obsessed with her looks and how people perceive her, so she says, I wish I was beautiful. So God makes her beautiful, and she waltzes into heaven. Now, the guy behind doesn't know what to decide, so he says, you know what, I wish I was really good-looking, too. And so God makes him good-looking, too, and the guy at the back of the line starts laughing. Now, the couple behind the first two people see them walk in, and they kind of get jealous, and they say, well, we wish we were beautiful, too. And so God makes them beautiful, they walk in, and the guy at the back of the line is laughing even louder. And as every single person wishes to be beautiful, the guy is laughing louder and louder. Eventually, God gets to him and says, what is your wish, my son? And the guy says, make them all ugly again. This looks like the perfect time to scream at the top of my fucking lungs. Jimmy, Jimmy, please don't die on me. Oh, God, no, Jimmy. Jimmy, I'd suck your dick for you to be alive. Oh, my God, he's alive. Oh, my baby's alive. It's a miracle. My prayers were answered. What did you say to I'm him? I'm good. Where are you going? That's your best friend. Yeah, yeah, I'm, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna head out. I'm, what I'm the heck? Out. Hey, what's going on, man? Can I get a 10-piece chicken nugget? Of course! Hey, would you like to donate a dollar to the Ronald McDonald House Foundation in support of orphans finding their biological mother and father? Fuck no! Beautiful language Pictures Comfortable 
Knoll. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, J, K, L, M, N, O. You guys are always messing up. Seriously, it's L, M, N, O. Child, it's L, M, N, O. Right, we ride together, we die together. I don't know about that now. Go ahead, P. Don't go ahead, P, me. Y'all always grouping together. Y'all supposed to be individual. Nah, girl, I'm sorry, but we've been doing this for years. This is L, M, N, O. Y'all confusing the kids. Let them be confused. Y'all, it's L, M, N, O. Oh, my gosh. Can we please just get along with the song? Shut up, because we really don't need you, Ed. Right. Every time somebody try to say a word that begin with you, they always say xylophone. <laughs> <laughs> or x-ray. <Yeah. laughs> I know y'all ain't talking, because I bet y'all all, all going to say the same thing. Watch this. What's a word that begin with A? Apple. <laughs> I'm sorry, A. He got us there. All right. That's the only thing I can think of. <laughs> Christian, can you come and help me? Mum, I'm in the middle of a game. But then pause it. I can't pause it, it's online. Fine, once you're finished, come and help me. He's pushing, he's coming, he's on me. He's literally on top of me, he's inside me. I finished him off. He took like 12 shots, I'm coming now. These guys are so sweaty, they're pushing from both sides. They keep hitting me from behind, I need some cover, someone cover my back. What the? They're all just destroying me from behind, they're gonna finish me off. What's happening in that game? I'm spraying, I'm spraying everywhere, I'm finishing. Oh, th that is disgusting. Finish two, these guys got clapped. Oh my lord, what is he doing in there? Alright, don't move, I'm coming. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, there's someone else on me. Last guy, he's down, I'm gonna finish. What game is he playing? Oh yes! Oh, feels so good, let's go baby! <laughs> Oh guys, I'm just gonna help my mum with something. I'll be back in two minutes. All right. Mom, what did you need me to help? <gasps> a man with a broken bass drum. A man dropping his trumpet. A woman in a yellow tank top. A woman in a green collared shirt. Waldo. There, there, a man in a white. <laughs> oh my god! Oh. oh my god, Ben. Huh? We went to the same middle school. <laughs> You were in my theater class. You helped me memorize all my lines. We were best friends. Don't you remember? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah the other remember. kids would call me slow. <laughs> Stupid. Sometimes they call me special, but you know what? I showed them something special. Made them disappear. Like a magician. No, Tyler, it's me, Ben. He's not Ben, I'm Ben. We went to middle school together. He's a liar! Shoot that motherfucker! <laughs> Class, who can answer the question on the board? Bobby! Fuck, what the fuck, man? I've been in your class a whole year, you still can't tell that I'm fucking blind? Oh wait, let me try to read No, it. no, no, Bobby, you don't- No? Still can't see fucking shit! Bobby, come on, man, he didn't mean Shut it. Shut the fuck up, Gary! I'm over here! Shut the fuck up! Putting kids to bed is the worst thing I've ever had to do in my life. I hate it with a passion. They will try anything. Last week, my kids are like, Oh, Dad, Dad! What? Can't sleep, there's a ghost in our room, there's a ghost in our room. Like a ghost, they go, yeah. I'm like, you sure? And they're like, yeah, yeah. There's a ghost in our room. Oh, man, well, fuck if I'm going in there then. So my mom decided to visit me, but the problem is my roommate's a girl. So she came over for dinner and she wouldn't stop talking about how pretty my roommate was. Throughout the course of the dinner, she's like really observing me and the roommate. And I can see that she's kind of getting suspicious about it. So me noticing this, I'm like, ma, I know what you're thinking, but I can assure you we're just roommates. Anyways, the dinner passes, and about a week later, my roommate comes up to me and was like, ever since your mother came for dinner, I haven't been able to find any of the silver plates. She said, now, nah, I'm not saying that she took it, but do you think she took it? I'm like, nah, I don't think so, but I could text her and ask. I text her, and I said, Ma, I'm not saying that you did take the silver plates from my house, but I'm also not saying that you didn't take them. But the fact of the matter is they've been missing ever since you came. She texted me back about 30 minutes later and she said, I'm not saying you do sleep with your roommate, but I'm not saying you don't. But the fact of the matter is, if she was sleeping on her own bed, she'd notice them under her pillow. I swear to God, steal one more of my cooking utensils, we're done. Our relationship is over. <laughs> well, that's a whisk I'm willing to do. Sorry, I had you guys waiting. Hi, mom. Hey, you. How are you? She's asking you a question. I'm good. That's great. Can I get your name really quick? You don't know your name? Olivia. Okay, do you have any allergies? Do you? No. Great, so what seems to be the problem here? Uh, her arm has been causing her a lot of pain. I'm sorry to hear that. Is it the left or the right arm? Her left one. Okay, and how long has it been causing you pain? Uh, um, a week. Alright, and does it hurt if you move stretch at all? 
Olivia, I don't have your arm, but yes, it does. Okay, one more thing. When's your date of birth? February 11th. Oh my. February 11th. And what year? 2022. Olivia, you were not born in 2022. Okay, you know what? How old are you? She's 21. A teacher was working with a group of children about the sense of taste, and she had brought a variety of flavor of lifesavers and told them to close their eyes and to taste them. The children were able to correctly identify the flavors of cherry, lemon, and mint, but when the teacher gave them a honey-flavored lifesaver, all the children were stumped. The teacher says, I'll give you a hint. It's something that your mommy probably always calls your daddy. All of a sudden, a little boy in the back of class stands up, spits his out, and yells, Quick, spit them out! They're assholes! Not <laughs> your fault. You're right. It's not my fault. It's your fault! Hey, how much are the books? Three dollars for one book, or ten dollars for three. Here's three dollars. Give me one book. Okay. Wait. Here's three dollars. Give me another one. Here you go. Here's another three dollars. Give me one more. Thank you. I just bought three books for $9. Are you dumb? I'm about to end this guy's whole career. This makes everybody buy three books instead of one. <laughs> Damn. I only have 20 minutes until I want to go to bed. Definitely not enough time to watch a TV show. I guess I'll just scroll on my phone for three hours instead. If you even touch him, he'll die. Okay, I'll be careful. Hey! I'm hover ending. Get well soon, brother. Motherfuck! Mom, mom. Yes, honey? When you were gone? Yeah? I saw Dad invite the lady next door. Oh. And they went upstairs and took their clothes. Wait, wait, stop right there. Finish the story at dinner time when everyone sits down, okay? Oh, okay. So, what's for dinner? I'm starving. Honey, was there something you wanted to say? Oh, right. So when mom was out, I saw dad invite the lady next door and they went upstairs and took their clothes off. And what else did they do after that, honey? And they did the same thing that mom and Uncle Jeff do all the time. Are you going to eat that sandwich I made you? Is this some sort of joke? What do you, what do you mean? Did you put a neutron star in my sandwich? No, of course not. What? It's just a sandwich. John, I could feel space and time warping. You put a neutron star in the sandwich. Warping? Nothing is warping. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. Why is it unfathomably dense? Maybe I cut the tomatoes too thick. John, I'm not falling for the neutron star sandwich prank. It's the oldest trick in the book. No, no, it's, it's a normal sandwich. Just take a bite. I'm just going to lift the bread a bit. I'm not hungry. Why? Just eat it! No, no, I, I believe you. I'm just not hungry. How about I wrap it up for later, and then you could just microwave it? John, this shit could microwave me. Hey, Steve, what's your price? W what do you mean? Every guy's got a price, you know, a dollar amount it would take for him to, you know what, another man. Oh, I, I have no idea. I've never thought about it. Come on, what, what's your price? Oh my gosh, it's got to be like a billion dollars. Deal, here's a billion dollars. No, I, I meant ten billion dollars. <laughs> Here's ten billion dollars. No, I, I... A deal's a deal, Steve. Don't let me get my lawyer involved. What? Let the Jerry know that this man agreed the second he named a dollar amount. Where'd you come from? I didn't agree to anything. Betty, would you mind rereading the minutes? Bill, what's your price? Steve, ten billion dollars. Bill, okay, deal. Steve, I'm excited to do this. What? That, that's not how it happened. Listen, Steve, we got it in writing, okay? You're either going to make this deal happen, or you're going to spend the rest of your life in prison where it's going to happen a lot more. This is so stupid. Why is this funeral at 9 a.m.? Why? Are you not a morning person? <coughs> Yo, come on. Oh, man, poor Jack. He used to love writing music. That's all right. At least he's still decomposing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm such a bad host. Can I get you guys something to drink? Oh, please, you're fine. I'll have a water when you get a second. Water? Got it. Dawn, did you want a water or anything? I'll do a root beer float. You can't just go to someone's house and ask them to make you a root beer float. Oh, I didn't know that. I mean, I would. I, I just don't have root beer. Oh, okay, it's fine. Uh, I'll just, I'll have a milkshake then. Dude, pick a household drink. I don't know which ones are. What did you get? Water. Water? Okay. Uh, do you have ice? Yeah, I have ice. I'll do a snow cone then. He's not gonna make you a snow cone! I don't know, I have a snow cone machine at my house. I have like 27 a day. You have 27 snow cones a day? I mean, I... What did you get? Water! I can hear you. 
Okay, I'm just gonna go home and get my snow cone machine. I'll be right back. How's the gambling going, man? It's been six months. Nice, that's great, man. Yeah, I don't think I'll gamble ever again. Yeah? I'll bet you 50 bucks. You're on. Damn it. Thank you. Double or nothing? Sure. Fuck! Uh, sir, it says here that you have a criminal record. Yes, I do. Can you tell me why you were arrested? My last interviewer did not hire me and I killed him. You, you start my name. Ow! What are all these clocks about? Well, these are lie clocks. Every time you tell a lie in your life, the hands will move. No way! So who's that clock there? That's Mother Teresa's clock. The hands never moved, so she never told a lie. Incredible! And this clock behind me? That's Abe Lincoln's clock. The hands moved twice, so he told two lies in his lifetime. So where's my clock? Ah, your clock is in God's office. He's using it as a ceiling fan. This little boy has this toy airplane that he loves to play with. He's in the living room playing with it. His mother's in the kitchen listening to him. And she hears him go, vroom, vroom, vroom. All you motherfucking people who want to get on, get on. All you motherfucking people who want to get off, get off. The mother, very angry, runs out, grabs the plane, and sends the kid upstairs to his room. About 15 minutes later, she goes back upstairs and she looks at him and she says, All right, listen. You can play with the plane if you don't use that foul language. Kid agrees. Goes back into the living room. Mom goes back into the kitchen. Mom listens. Vroom, vroom. All you wonderful people who want to get on, get on. All you wonderful people who want to get off, please get off. And if you have a problem with the 15-minute delay, you can go talk to that fucking bitch in the kitchen. Your mother told me that you got kicked out of school again. Yeah, I got in a fight with some kid because he stole my things. Fuck. Did you win at least? Yeah. I wiped the floor with him. I, I even went and kissed the girl he had a crush on afterwards. Brad, we've spoken about this before. You have to focus on your work. Girls, Girls come second. Girls come second, I, I know. Good. Now, come on. Let's find you another job. I didn't even like being a janitor anyway. For the crime you have committed, I sentence you to 68 years in prison. Your Honour, my client has requested if you could add one more year. If I have to wake up early, then I'm gonna stay up late. If I have something to do, then I'm gonna procrastinate. If there's work to be done, I'll find other work to do. I'll focus on literally anything but what I'm supposed to. She was so nasty and so rude I that I don't so even, nasty don't ever bring so anybody rude. around me like that. So nasty and that's what happened. so rude. So nasty and so rude. This French guy, this British guy, and this guy from Brooklyn are somehow all together in the Amazon rainforest. They end up getting captured by cannibals. The cannibal chief looks at him and says, You are on sacred ground. For this, you must die. We are going to kill you, we are going to skin you, and we're going to use your skin to make canoes. But to show you we're not total savages, we're going to let you pick which way you're going to die. The French guy says, Bring me poison. The British guy says, Bring me a gun. The guy from Brooklyn says, Bring me a fork. All of a sudden, the French guy says, Viva la France! Drinks the poison, dies. The British guy says, God save the queen! Shoots himself in the head, dies. All of a sudden, the guy from Brooklyn picks up the fork and says, Here, here's your fucking canoe, you cocksucker! This time you'll have to prepare a lobster. Oh, okay. A sandwich. <laughs> My pet lobster Terry loves his sandwiches! <laughs> Miss Johnson? What's wrong, Jimmy? Oh, nothing's wrong, but I saw you on the internet last night. The, the internet? Where on the internet? How'd you get stuck in a washing machine? Jimmy, why, why were you looking at that video? How'd you get stuck in the washing machine, Miss Johnson? There was space. You could have backed out. J Jimmy, why were you watching that video? And then the dude who came to help you wasn't even helping, Miss Johnson. What was he doing? He just had to pull you out. Like honestly, Miss Johnson, I'm not even gonna lie. You look stupid. Like you look You're stupid. You're only five years old. Why would you look oh, you must be here for this year's annual being early competition. No, I'm here for next year's annual being early competition. Dear God, he's amazing. Um, excuse me. What the actual fuck? That's why I don't think anything. I mean, not you. You don't think something like that? You don't think something like that? I look like a tree. I look like a brain. I look like an umbrella. Yeah, can we change the subject, please? You, madam, are the most beautiful gym that I have ever laid eyes upon. You both. Would you do me the honor of being my bride? Uh, I don't know you. So yes, it's a, it's a no. Oh, it's a no. I don't right. I don't know you, bro. It's a no. I right? I'm not doing that. I'm cool. I'm chilling. 
Hey guys, I found a witch! Hey, oh, nah, 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 nah. You're a sick woman. You were here to meet this 16-year-old boy that was really our undercover agent, Mike. You're going to jail, bitch. Mike, everything you said was a lie? Why are you acting like we're- No, not every- Mike, Mike, you need to shut up. Why are you acting like we're in the wrong right now? I can't believe I'm being catfish right now, Mike. How can you say those things and not mean them? Man, what the fuck are you talking about? This isn't catfish. You're a I, I did mean Mike, I, I Mike, did. Mike, what the fuck is going on with you, bro? Ma'am, you're going to jail because you're a weird fuck. Mike, we need to talk, bro. On everything I love, we need to- Yeah, mate, I made you a cup of tea. Be careful, it's hot. Oh, thanks, mate. Imagine I threw this tea right in his fucking face right now. You right, mate? Yeah, sorry, mate. There you go. Until your court date, this is gonna be your state. AKA the Jets. Hey man, I didn't do it, bro. I didn't do that. Follow I'm me. You, I didn't do it. This, this, this jail right here? Yes, this is jail. What do you mean? Since when was there a fountain in a jail? There's always been fountains in jail. But wait, weren't you saying you weren't the one that did it? Oh no, yeah, I did it. Yeah, I, I did it. Yeah, I was just joking around, you know what I'm saying? Seeing where y'all minds was at. Shout out to that police officer. Dad, Courtney punched me today. Damn it, Derek knocked me the fuck out. How? How did I thought I died? Who instigated and when I came to? I thought I was in heaven praising the Lord. What is this girl's? But then I felt another blow to my lip, and I realized I'm I'm still in this fight. Okay, so I know you don't want me to. And so so I get up and and I look at her. I'm like I'm mad now, and I I can see this fear in her eye, and I'm like I gotta take advantage of this. So I lunge at her like I'm a freaking lion, man. And and she uppercutted me, and I'm back with the Lord. And another swirl there, and done. <laughs> what? No, it's nothing, it's just, you know. If you got something to say, just say it. Well, it's just not very good, is it? What? I mean, the, the sky looks nothing like that. Yeah, but it's my interpretation. Alright. What's your problem? No, it's, you know, just maybe there's a reason why you've only sold one painting your whole life. You've always got something negative to say, haven't you? Well, it's hardly anything positive to say. Right, I've had enough of you. Oh, you've had enough of me, have you? Yeah, I have, actually. Yeah? Yeah. And what are you gonna do about it? <sighs> Did not see that coming. Stephanie, I'm at the mall and I see your boyfriend walking around with some fat bitch. Jess, what do you mean? I'm with my boyfriend right now. Siblings, 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 this is my sister. This is my brother. We are siblings and we care for each other. Everything we own, we always share. Because we are siblings and we have the same hair. I like knitting. And I like coins. We both came out of the same loins. If you don't like siblings, give us a chance. We'll impress you with our sibling dance. What's that? We have an older brother. We thought there were two. But there is another. He's always busy and he has short hair. But he's one of us, so we don't care. Come on, Patrick, snap out of that trance. It's time to do a sick. Guys, guys, I can't focus, I can't read, I can't get any of my work done with you guys making this racket about sibling dances. Sometimes I think I can talk to plants. Come on, let's do a sibling dance. Oh my god, Callum, just admit you're wrong! What do you mean? Everyone knows Henry VIII had six wives! He didn't! He had three, Callum! Three of them were girlfriends! No, Dirt! Do you have a brain? Did you even go to school? Fine, I'll Google it then! Yeah, Prove look you're it an up. idiot! I Thank will! You. And you're All gonna right. look like a flipping twat! Oh, am I? Yeah, you are! Yeah! <sighs> what does it say then? Huh? Give me a minute! I'm looking! Flipping hell! Have you found I'm it? I'm sorry, but why are we even arguing about this? What do you it's mean? ridiculous. We've got one life on this world and we're spending it arguing about nothing. Well, that's not Let's relevant. Let's just forget about it. I want to know the Let's answer. Let's forget about it. I want to know the answer. We don't know the answers to everything, Callum. I'm not a scientist. Prick. Let's forget about it. I'm so glad we could finally hang out today. Aww, you're so sweet. Itzel, can I tell you something? Yeah, what's up? I really like you. Aww. Too. Wait, really? Yeah! As a friend. Actually, as a best friend. A brother. Mm, no, my dad. Are you okay? <laughs> oh, where am I? You're in the friend zone, my guy. No! You're one of us now. I've been here for 13 years. No!
You don't understand. My man is so loyal, he watches porn with no girls in it. I'm a teller. Don't you dare. An old man crashes his car into an expensive automobile. The owner of the expensive automobile gets out and he confronts the old man. He tells him, you give me $10,000 cash or I will beat you to a pulp. The old man says, whoa, buddy, I'm sorry, I don't have that kind of money, but let me call my son, he trains dolphins. The old man starts to dial his son, and before he speaks into the phone, the man with the expensive automobile yanks the phone out of his hand and says, so you train dolphins. Well, your old man damaged my car. You better bring me $10,000 cash right now or I'm going to beat the heck out of him and you. The son says, I'll be there in 15 minutes. In exactly 15 minutes, a jeep pulls up. Six men get out and start pummeling the man with the expensive car. Meanwhile, the son approaches his father and says, Dad, I train Navy SEALs, not dolphins. Mommy, why is some of your hair white? Mm, because every time you make me sad, one hair turns white. Oh, really, Mommy? So what do you do to Grandma? A man and his wife own a ranch and have just lost one of their bulls. They need to replace it, but only have $500. Yeah. The wife tells her husband, I'll go to the market and see if I can find one for under 500 If I can, I'll send you a telegram. She goes to the market and finds one for four ninety nine. Having only $1 left, she goes to the telegraph office and finds out that it costs $1 per word. She's stumped on how to tell her husband to bring the wagon and trailer. Finally, she tells the telegraph operator to send the word comfortable. Skeptical, the operator asks, how will he know to come with a trailer from just that one word? He's a slow reader. Back at the ranch, the husband reads the telegraph. Come for to bull. I'm on my way, honey. I just don't get why you take everything so literally. Because, Dad, can I, can I be totally transparent with yes, you? Yes, please do. <gasps> now is not the time, Tom. <gasps> okay, fine, I have a problem. Yes, I know. So can you stop playing games with me? Oh, but I have a really good hand. I don't care. Oh, right. That I'm is, sorry, okay? No, I, I gave I'm you a warning. Now no, you're in no, trouble, please, okay? Please. No, now come here. <clears throat> Devin, this is for you. A bag? Yep. I love bags. No, no, but there's something in it. What? Open it. No. Just open it. No, I don't want it. Kevin, open the damn Take it out. No, no, you're going to like it. I swear, just open it. <gasps> a little bag. See, I told you. A little bag. No. No. I told you he was going to cry. If you have anxiety, throw it out the window. Self-hatred, out the window. That thing that reminds you of your ex and heartbreak, out the window. That demon that eats your socks, that doesn't even like socks, but eats them to piss you off, out the window. That one baby in the airplane that's making everyone angry, out the window. Oh, no! Don't worry, I caught the baby, everything's fine. <sighs> so maybe not everything out the window. Oh, we are not using that. Well, that is a horrible name for a fruit. What, what if you just put the letter G at the start of the word? Oh, grape. I like it. Good name. Good name. Good name. All right, next one. Wait, um, grapes are fruit? Yeah. So we have grape, which is a fruit. Mm -hmm. uh, and then mm -hmm. we also have grapefruit, which is also a fruit. Yeah. Yeah. I don't see a problem with that. Me neither. Moving on. Uh, I was thinking the name for this one could be tomato. How about tomato? Put both down. Good Put idea. Down. That way it won't cause any arguments. Okay, next up, uh, what should we call this? Hmm... Mm, I want to say orange. That's literally what I was thinking. Because of the colour? Because of the mm. colour, yeah. That's yeah, a really exactly. good name. That's I mean, really it's literally name. orange. Like, what, what exactly. Wrong there? I yeah. cannot see yeah. us regretting this. What about this one? Oh, it's the same colour. It's the same colour. Oh, Pointy orange? No. Orange, uh, orange with hair. Great. Long skip orange. Skip that one. Uh, yeah. Skip, skip. Carrot. Ooh, that um, could work. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That could work. Fuck that could it. work. Just put it down. Hey, son. So I just found out I have some free time this weekend, which means we have time to go on a camping trip if, if you'd like that. Oh, camping. I, I never really enjoyed those, to be honest. What? I never really liked those camping trips. Hey, hey no, wait, hold on, Dad. I, I didn't mean it like that, I swear. I really didn't mean it like hey, that. Hey, no, no, no. Hey, buddy. Buddy, it's fine. Is it, though? Yes, seriously, seriously. I'm good. I'm really good. Okay, all right, all right. Oh, my God. <laughs> Okay, I take it back. How can you say that? Oh, 
Oh my god, dad, I'm gonna be in a Mr. Beast video. Oh my god, that's very good, so that means you're gonna be rich. About that, he will only give me money if I do exactly as he says. Okay, so do whatever he wants. Okay, this is him. Um, Mr. Beast? Hello, this is Yahya with Yes, me. it is. Okay, if you do all four of these challenges, you will win the grand prize of one million dollars. Oh my god. What did he say? He said I will win one million dollars. Okay, what do you want me to do, Mr. Beast? For your first challenge, I want you to tell your dad that you love him. Oh, that's easy. I love you, dad. Oh, he seems like a good person. Now I want you to punch him. What? If you want to win a million dollars, you have to punch your dad in the face. What did he say? He said I have to punch you. Do it. What? No. Yeah, hey, this is one million dollars. You know how much this money can help. Now do it. Oh my god. Ah! Oh, it's worth it. It's worth it. Okay, what well, now? Now for the third challenge, we cut out all water and food sources from you guys. Whoever survives the longest will be the winner of the one million dollars. <gasps> I've ran 200 miles, I've ran through the deserts, I've ran through the mountains, through the hills, to give you this message. Oh, what does it say? Gloria has left you on red. Oh, shit, really? Yeah, oh. yeah. Could you send her back an eggplant emoji? Yeah, sure thing. Yeah. Alright, cheers. Alright, bye yeah. These two guys are working in a factory. One guy says to the other, he goes, hey, I bet you I can get the boss to give me a day off. Guy says, how's that gonna happen? Guy says, watch. So he climbs up to the second floor and he hangs upside down and the boss comes in and he looks up and he sees him. He goes, what are you doing? And the guy says, I'm a light bulb. And the boss goes, I think you've been working too hard. You might be going a little crazy. Why don't you take the day off? So he goes to leave. The other guy follows him out and the boss says, and where do you think you're going? And the guy says, I'm going home. I can't work in the dark. One night, this man got down on his knees and he prayed, Dear Lord, I go to work eight hours a day and my wife stay home all day doing nothing. I pray that you switch our bodies so that she can see what I go through all day. So the next morning he woke up, he was in his wife's body. He had to get up and make breakfast early in the morning, get the kids ready for school, took the kids to school. On his way back from school, he had to stop and pay a couple bills, stop by the grocery store to grab some things for dinner at night, got home, started making dinner. When they sat down to watch TV up, it was time to pick the kids up, jumped up. When they picked the kids up on the way back home, they were arguing. Got home, helped the kids with their homework, finished making dinner, fixed the dinner table. They ate, when they took the kids a bath, put them in the bed, went in there and finished cleaning up, when they took a shower, came in the bed, laid down and was tired, but it was expected to make love, made love without complaining. Got down on the knees and said, dear Lord, I pray that you forgive me. I don't know what I was thinking. I apologize. Please switch our bodies back. I learned my lesson. The Lord said, yep, I think you learned your lesson, but you got to wait nine months. You got pregnant last night. <laughs> Okay, for the last time, for real, for the last time, man, if you see the dude in a blue shirt, you kill him. That is your job, okay? I'm doing a good thing, right? Yeah, whatever, go new guy. Call me back when you're done. Thank you. Bye. Oh my god, I'm gonna get an aneurysm. Holy sh- Hey, so the new guy's test results came in. Oh, great. Does it say he has no balls? No, but he's colorblind. H Hello? I killed the guy in the blue shirt. He was with his family. I had to kill all of them. Guy wakes up to a gorilla on his roof. So he Googles and he finds a gorilla removal service. So he calls and the guy says, I'll be there in 30 minutes. 30 minutes later, the guy shows up. He gets out of his van and he's got a ladder, a baseball bat, a shotgun, and a mean old pit bull. And the homeowner says, so what are you going to do? And the guy says, I'm going to set up the ladder. I'm going to go up the ladder. I'm going to knock the gorilla off the roof with the baseball bat. He's going to fall. At that point, the pit bull is trained to grab the gorilla's testicles and he's not going to let go. Then I'm going to take the gorilla. I'm going to put him in a cage, put him in the van and get the hell out of here. And the homeowner says, okay. So the guy gets his stuff. He walks towards the ladder. Just before he goes up, he hands the homeowner a shotgun and the homeowner says, what's this for? And the guy says, in case that gorilla knocks me off the roof, you shoot that fucking dog. Hey, how funny would it be if I just let go? What? Well, you know, just like, I trusted you. Stop. Stop. Stop, dude! No, I'm kidding, bro. I'm not that evil. Jeez. Oh, dude, for a second, I thought you were gonna... What you're going to do now is subtract two, just like how my ex-wife divorced me and took custody of our two kids. I hate this class so much. Seriously, dude, I wish something interesting would happen. Same. Mom, are you approachable? Go ahead. As you know, I'll be turning 18 next week and there will be some changes in this house. My curfew is no longer 10 p.m., it's 2 a.m. I will no longer be responsible for your other two sons when you're not here. I am grown and responsible for myself. I will no longer ask you to go places. I will just be telling you. If you have an issue with me, you can no longer put your hands on me because it then will be considered assault. Is that all?
Yep. Well, then I too will be making some changes. Since you will be an adult, you are not responsible for getting yourself to and from school. I don't give rides to adults. Also, I cook for children, not adults. You'll need to get a job. I'll need rent money and light bill money. As for your curfew, you will not be able to gain access to my home after 10 p.m. Me and my children will be sleeping. Where you went is where you will stay. As for me putting my hands on you, as an adult, I will now throw hands with you. And because I am a petty mother, I'll call the cops after and tell them a grown-ass man just put his hands on me. Sounds good? We have a deal? Hi, Timmy. I was your grandpa's friend in the war. Your grandpa really loved his watch, and he wanted to pass it down to you guys, but we got captured. He was not going to let anyone take the watch from him, so he hit it up his ass. He died carrying it. This is the watch. Hey, man, what the fuck was up with that text you sent me? Oh, it's because of your allergy. It was a picture of a dead body. Did you not read the caption, dude? It was, you after eating a peanut, be like. <laughs> Incredibly disturbing, ruined my whole day. Okay, where'd you even find that? In the woods. You took the picture? Yeah. Call the cops! Inform law enforcement! What the fuck? Why would I rat on myself to the cops? You killed him? Yeah. Do you not remember? Remember what? It's you. <laughs> what? I don't... Really, it's you after eating a peanut. What? I'm sorry. I regret it. I didn't mean for it to be this way. I miss you. I really, I really miss you. I just hate a liar. Like, I... What are you, you what? You said pass me the iron. No, the fuck I didn't. Bro, I'm so hungry. Why would you call me ugly? I... Bitch, I said hungry. I just need a sign. Oh, like, I'm a Sagittarius. That's not what I meant, you fucking you dumb. Just gonna check and see if the house is safe before I go to bed. Hey, are there any stabbers down there? No, it's okay. Okay, good. Put your money in the bag! Put it in! Yo, look at this one over here. No, nah, I wouldn't mess with him, man. For what? Look, man, look at what we doing, okay? We is robbing the place, okay? This dude right here, he's just standing there like nothing's going on, okay? He's chilling, all right? That's a whole anime protagonist. I wouldn't mess with him. No, no, I'm, t I'm telling you. Look at look at the way he's sitting right now. He's going to end up killing you, and then I'm going to have to run. I'm not going to be able to get away. He's going to catch me because they're overpowered, and then I'm going to get killed. This look like the pilot episode to his anime. I'm telling you, we should not be doing this. Man, you watch too many of them Japanese cartoons. I'm gonna I'm go beat them up. What? No, why would you put the money in the bar? Kimiwa, Kokoni Kirubakata Wanakata. He did. Hey, what's this guy talking about? Oh, oh, here's a man! Here's a man! What do you even want with Earth, anyways? I plan to rebuild this planet, bring back the thriving ecosystem that once was, and return the extinct animals back to their lands. And freedom, true freedom, for all people. Wait a minute, what? Why have we been fighting? That that sounds amazing. We, oh, we're the heroes of this planet. We want to accomplish the same thing. So, like, maybe we team up. Like, what? well, the first step is to get rid of all minorities. Okay, there it is. There it is. I knew there was something. But you know, you had me with the plan. The execution needs a little bit of work. Okay, I don't. I don't really understand the relation between extinct animals and minorities. They I don't relate. They relate. No, they don't. They do. I thought you said you wanted all people to be free. Freedom from minorities, yes. Okay, yeah, now, now everything is starting to make sense. That's why his name is Color Correction. It wasn't clicking before, but but now it is. And the, the M on your chest with the X in it, I, I was like, his name starts with a C. Why does he have an M on his chest? But it means no minorities. No minorities. Right? Yeah, 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 okay. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're going to have to fucking kill you. So you know how women get pregnant? Yes, dude, I, I know how babies are made. What? No, no, not that. Oh. So you know how in the late stages of development of a child, they usually kick around and stuff like that, right? Go on. So, the baby is kicking a pregnant woman. I mean, yeah, if you put it like that. But when I do it, everybody just gets mad at me and now the police are after me. What did you do? Exactly what the baby did. What? Dude, this world is full of hypocrisy. No, it's full of crazy people like you. I got the guy who killed your son, boss. Boss, I'm sorry, but you said kill him, and then you said you must not. It could have happened to anyone. You're right. Shut up. Should I finish this, boss? And his life. No, wait. Oh. Slowly. Wait, what? I want him to feel every cut, every punch, every blow. I want it to take weeks, no, months. I want him to pray for the sweet release of death. He was right, it can't happen to anyone. Avenging my only son is all I care about. All I live for, all that remains, all that matters. Now. 
Are you ready for pain? Here's how to negotiate a good deal at a car dealership. So your total is 4,500. Please sign here. Well, I want $10,000 off the price of the car. Sir, but it's only 4,500. He doesn't know that I know this. I have a gun. So I got a couple of fish there and over there's my parrot. Oh, cool. Shut the f up. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't listen to him. Right. <laughs> I can't let you live. You said some weird stuff. Uh, okay, parrot. See? <laughs> right. Anyway, I also have a cat if you want to see Hide the body. Hide the body. You're not actually paying any attention to him, are you? You know what? Um, if you'll excuse me, I actually have to be going now. God damn parrot. Whoa, uh, hey. I, I, was I wasn't even listening to him. <laughs> I can't let you live. I can't let you live. Shut the fuck up! Uh, when you were... What you said when he okay, yes, but... What you said when he okay, yes, but... Uh... What the fuck? Hey, what's up? I can't figure out number four. I keep doing multiplication and it's not working. A number four, you said? Yeah, number four. Ooh. Uh, okay. 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 Um, class. Class, everyone look at me, please. I'm getting a little concerned. Honestly, walking around the room, I've noticed um, some people are doing multiplication for number four. Remember, this is Spanish class. There's no... That on this exam. Pierce, I'm not being funny. I think your girlfriend's cheating on you. I think you're right. That wasn't very funny. Truth or dare? Dare, go on. I dare you to wear your hat backwards. No! <laughs> go on, dare. It's your go. Truth or dare? Dare. I dare you to not exist. What? Where'd he go? Michael. Truth or dare? No. It's not your go anymore. Truth. Or dare? Truth! I, I pick truth! Is it true that you don't exist? What? No! John! Oh god, no! Truth or dare? Truth or dare? Dare! Okay! I dare you to put your glasses on upside down! Okay. And if you ever fix them, I'll fucking kill you. Oh. Dad, I accidentally crashed your truck. You did what? Oh, it's... It's okay, it was just an accident. Really? You're not mad? No, I'm not mad. How about we go to the park and play catch? Yeah, let's go. Dad, what park are we going to? We're going to this new one that just opened. We're almost there. Oh, okay. Dad, are we almost there? It's getting really dark and I'm kind of scared. How do you think I'm gonna feel when I have to walk back alone? Here. Okay guys, please make sure to put your phones on airplane mode at this time. We don't want any accidents happening. Fuck that. We all know that doesn't actually do anything. Mayday! Mayday! We're going down! Okay, who the fuck did to put their phone on airplane mode? Bro, what the fuck? Three dinosaurs are searching for food when they find a magic lamp. They rub it and a genie appears. The genie says, since there are three of you, you each get one wish. The first dinosaur says, I want meat. So he gets a piece of meat. The second dinosaur wants to one-up him. So he says, I want uh, a meat shower. So he gets a shower of meat. The third dinosaur wants to one-up that. So he says, I want uh, a meteor shower. And that's the dinosaurs went extinct. There was a very hungry, genetically modified caterpillar. Seven nuclear missiles. You want to see a magic trick? Please don't steal my wallet. I'm not going to steal your wallet this time. That's what you said last time, and then you stole my wallet. What'd you do? Your mom is pregnant. That snap did not just get my mom pregnant. Nine months. You do not know a magic trick that gets my mom nine months pregnant. The baby comes out and it's just garlic. Did you just say the baby was garlic? Dude, there's a... Hey, mom. Listen, Timothy, I do not know what the fuck is going on. Hey, thanks for dining with us. Uh, it is Tuesday, so kids eat free today. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Oh, wow. Sure is. So what can I get for you? Well, I'm not really that hungry, so I'm just gonna have a water. Okay. 
Uh, what about you, Derek? I'm gonna start off with the chicken tenders and the french fries. And I'll have the T-bone steak, medium well. Loaded baked potato, cornbread, and the core is light. And then that's everything. I got the money, come on, kill the witness! Did, did you draw a dollar sign on the bag? Yeah, so we know which bag is the money bag. How many bags do we have? One. So wouldn't that be the money bag? What is your problem with my dollar sign? I don't know, maybe I just wanted some class, you know? My gun doesn't have the word gun on it. This whole thing just feels a little goofy now. I can ignore your pretentiousness when we get home, now kill this fool! No, please, I'm not a witness, I'm blind! He says he's blind. Yeah, I'm right here, I heard him. How many fingers am I holding up? Uh, I don't know, two? Boom, he's lying, kill him. Wait, no, that's sheer coincidence, why would I say the right thing? Just, just do it again! Um... Four? Kill him! No, 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 again, coincidence, please, give me one more try, both of you, hold up as many fingers as you want! I swear we don't have time for this. Okay, uh, three on your left hand, and one on your right, and five on your left hand, and your right hand isn't up. There's no way I got that right. Oh, come on! The worst she can say is no, bro. You got this. I got this. Thanks, man. Talk to you later. Hey, um, I was wondering if you wanted to go out with me. Get out of my house! How did you get it? Saying no was not the worst thing she could have said. Is that your car? You don't see the door open? Oh, yeah, sorry. I'm just getting into a random person's car? I was just trying to say it's a nice car. What a fucking idiot. <sighs> Yo, what the hell are you doing? Hey, did you have to be an asshole just now, or were you born this way? I'm sorry. I knew this was your car. I just wanted to say you had a nice car and didn't know how to break the ice. I understand. Do you? Yeah. Then why go out of your way to make me feel dumb? I don't know. Because just... you're an asshole. Yes. Well, uh, unfortunately, there are consequences for your actions today. <laughs> you're not going to shoot me in broad daylight. I'm not going to shoot you at all. This is a, this is a Nerf gun. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not crazy. <laughs> I'm a... I'm a psychopath. I'm going to stab you. What? Remember, even if you delete things from your browser history, it will still be saved on your router. Until we meet again! Okay, Jack, so how are you finding the medication? Yeah, pretty, pretty good. Do you feel more independent? Yeah. Did your imaginary friend just tell you to say that? No. I'm gonna up your prescription a little bit. That seems fair. So you're gonna to wanna to up it to about four tablets per day. You wanna make sure that you've eaten just before uh, you, you take your, your pills, I'd say. It's a hey dad, can I go to my girlfriend's house tonight? Ooh, you're trying to go to a girl's house tonight? Yeah, I mean, I'd like to. Man, look at you, are you about to get some? Hey man, I mean, if she lets me, you know what I'm talking about? Wow, my little boy's starting to become a man. I mean, what can I say, dad? The ladies at school, they all love me. All right, relax, son. You're like a six on a good day. Okay. But yes, you can go to your girlfriend's house tonight. Sweet. Thanks, Dad. Hey, Dad, can I go to my boyfriend's house tonight? What? Well, no. No. What? Why not? Because I said so, and you're not allowed to talk to boys until you're at least 35. Oh my God, Dad, please? No, and you know what? In fact, you're grounded for even talking to a guy. Ugh. Sir, do you know why I pulled you over today? Because you think I am the Asian, so I can't drive. No, you were going 35 on the highway. You dumb shit, that's the speed limit, see? Yeah, that's the highway number. Oh, 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 shit. Sorry, one second. 1038, some lunatic was driving over 250 miles per hour on US I-245. Suspect appears to be Asian with a red vest. Honestly, <laughs> I'm, I'm impressed because I had no idea that minivans could even go that fast. Sir, please step out of the vehicle. I am not going back to jail, toodaloo, motherfucker! You know, I just love humans that care about the animal king. Me too, girl. Thank you for saving us from that flea market. I was so scared. But you came and saved the day. Oh, 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 oh. y'all, she making us a bad. I know, that's right. We in a luxury hotel, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's bubbling, y'all. Girl, you got us a jacuzzi.
Oh, she love us because you know jacuzzi is not shit. Hell no, girl. How much you pay for this jacuzzi? Ooh, oh, God. Oh, oh. oh. Girl, she put Epsom salt in the jacuzzi. Go oh, ahead. That's right. Girl, I don't even got arthritis and you giving us Epsom salt. Now, that that's a good one. What brand of Epsom salt that is? That's Dr. T. Let me see. Let me see. Uh -oh. Uh oh, oh, she picking me up, y'all. She picking me up. You about to be in that jacuzzi. I can't wait to join you. Oh, 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 oh. oh. She is enjoying the jacuzzi. That jacuzzi yeah. must feel real good. <laughs> Hell yeah, she started screaming for joy. How that jacuzzi feel? It's burly. Oh. And that's why parents are the best. Am I right? Who here disagrees? Sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. But why? Because this is a fucking orphanage. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna head out. Hey man, how's work? It's such a shitty day today. Ugh, how? Everybody was giving me shit today. Everybody was giving you shit today? Yeah. Even your boss? My boss was giving me the most shit. My boss oh, was giving me shit all day. Bro, that's gross. Everybody's blaming me for leaving shit all over the break room. I, I clean up my shit. Nobody should be leaving shit in the break room. Nobody. I'm not a clean freak, but a little brownie crumbs, specs. I think that's okay. I don't think that's okay. I don't think that's up to health code. But when people are leaving shit all over the place, that's not cool. Yeah, yeah. And everybody's just leaving shit on my desk. Oh my and I'm God. like, that's not my shit. Why? Why? I had so much to do and I had to leave, so there's just a bunch of shit just waiting there for me in the morning. Won't it smell? What? I don't understand what you do. I nah, but for real, bro, it has been too long since the last time we hung out. Nah, dude, too long. Yeah. But, but wait, yo, last time we hung out, you told me you were the girl, right? Oh, she broke up with me. Yeah. Mm, she yeah. left me for another man. Damn. Oh, shit. Sorry, bro. It's all good. Yeah, sorry to bring that up, dude. You couldn't have known. It's good. Yeah, but, but wait, didn't didn't you have a dog, though? He died last week. My dog died. Shit. Bro, I'm so sorry to bring that up, dude. It's all good. Yeah. Uh, wait, didn't you have two dogs? Yeah, they killed each other. They killed each other. Damn. Okay. Shit, bro. Um. Well, all right. On a lighter note, maybe... Next week, we, we could get together, go to, like, Starbucks or something. Their names were Starbucks. Oh, their names were Starbucks? Yeah, yeah, it's been really but, hard. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, well, okay, well, there's another coffee place near me. They, oh, they sell these dope cookies. We could, like, get it. They in. died fighting over a cookie. They died fighting over a cookie. Shit. I am sorry. <laughs> Damn, that's embarrassing. Uh, I cannot catch a break. <laughs> like my uncle before he jumped. What? So how did you die? What's your story? I froze to death. Oh, jeez, that must have been so painful. I mean, the ad was, but after a while, you kind of go numb, so you don't really feel as much. How did you die? Well, I had always suspected that my wife was cheating on me, so I rushed home early from work, and it turns out she was just in the kitchen. Yeah, and what happened after that? Well, I was still suspicious something was going on, so I ran into our bedroom looking for any sort of evidence, and there was nothing. I then checked our bathroom looking for some evidence. There was still nothing. I even ran into our backyard looking for evidence. Nothing. Finally, I ran around so much that I collapsed and died. Man, if you would just check the refrigerator, we'd both be alive right now. What? All right, all right, ten more seconds. Come on, guys. If any of you come down, I'll make a personal promise to make your life hell. Ten, nine, eight. Sir, did you just come down? I'm sorry, sir. I just couldn't hold it any longer. Oh, that, that's okay. We all make mistakes. Just not in my class. Now, who else wants to come down? You, sir, what's your reason for being here? Um, I don't, I don't know. I'm, so, I'm sorry, you don't what? I, I just don't know. Well, you better know soon. No, please don't shoot me. Now answer me. Why are you doing this? I really don't know, sir. Please spare me. You better come up with an answer. I really don't know. Is it your family? Maybe. I, I don't know. Is it your friend? Maybe, sir. Is it your physical well-being? It could be. Oh, what is it, son? Speak up. Now I want to get to 169 pounds, sir. What? 169 pounds for the memes, sir. For the what? The memes. Everyone come down. Aesthetic. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Oops, got your mental illness. Joke's on you, you can keep it. <laughs> Do y'all got that friend that eats at the fucking speed of light? Yo, here's your sandwich. I don't know if you're allergic to anything in it, but I, I think there's salami and where's your sandwich? What sandwich? Being depressed is so weird. Like, how are you this bad at being a human? All right, time to be productive. Co, this is water. You need to drink water to survive, so you're gonna drink the water. No. What do you mean, no? You can't just- Okay, I guess you can. Give me one good reason not to quit my job right now. Because you need money. Give me one good reason I need money. To pay rent. Give me one good reason I need to pay rent. To have a roof over your head. Give me one good reason I need a roof over my head. So you don't die. Give me one good reason I don't need to die. Because your family needs you. 
uh, I guess they give me one good reason my family need me. Uh, I'm going home. Mm. Guys, this dip is delicious. Who made this? Oh, uh, which one? Uh, the one that's in this tiny little crock pot plugged into the wall. That's, uh, the, that's the Sensi. You're not dipping your chips in that, right? Right. Uh, which dip did you mean then? Me? Yeah. I didn't. I didn't say anything. Okay, but that's not a dip though, and it's not a crock pot. Right. Yeah. It's it's just really close to the dip table. What? I'm just worried because it's really close to the dip table. Why is almost all of the melted wax gone? No, I dumped it out. Yeah, I just didn't want people to get confused. Nobody's going to get confused. No, I think somebody, I think some people might be confused about what is and isn't a dip here. Did you get confused? No. Beans. Beans? JB, I want you to meet my new boyfriend! Uh, I'm pretty busy right now. Hey champ, how's it going? Cool room! Yeah, whatever. Don't like champ, eh? That's alright. How's about Blue Dragon 72? Blue Dragon 72? I haven't used that name since I was 10. Is that right? Wait a minute. It can't be. Call a juicy, right? I told you I'd bang your mum. Okay, your total is $11.57. Cash or card? Quick, fast food places don't want you to know this one trick. Why did you kidnap me? Shall I end him, boss? Kill him! You must not. Wait, what? For he is my only son. Ever since we lost his beloved mother and baby brother in that wretched accident, he is all the family I have left in this dark world. I've been watching him from the shadows for 30 years, gazing proudly as he became a man, waiting for the perfect time to reveal myself to him. That time has finally come. Son? Okay guys, so this is what not to do. And those were the last words George the firearm safety instructor ever said. Hey guys, look, it's opposite day. And those were the last words Jerry the electric chair operator ever said. So like, what time will you be here? Hey, what do I do with this? Hold on, Dave. And that was the last thing Dave the Grenade Catcher ever heard. Okay, what would you do if Medusa was here right now? I'd probably freak out. Well, Bill, why don't you take a look at who's standing behind you? <gasps> and that was the last thing Bill ever saw. When we go in this restaurant, you are 12. Mom, I am 18! <laughs> and would you like a kid's menu? Yes, I do. Oh, I hope you don't mind. I invited my friend over who's really into smoothies. That's fine. I love smoothies. Don't tell him that. Hey! Sorry I'm late. I was making a making smoothie. A smoothie. Yeah, we know. Guess what's in it? It doesn't matter what's in your smoothie. You! Guess what's in my smoothie. You don't have to guess what's in his smoothie. Don't let him get to you. No, it's fine. I'll guess. Is it, uh, carrots? What? I don't know. Who is this guy? Does he work for you? No, he doesn't work for me. Did he tell you to say carrots? I didn't tell him to say carrots. He just doesn't know what's in the smoothie. Yeah, I, I like smoothies too, though. Don't tell him that! Are you trying to drink my smoothie? No, that's not what I meant. He doesn't want your smoothie. He's trying to chug my smoothie right in front of me. I wasn't. This is my smoothie. I need this. Yeah, oh, here we go. He's gonna chug the whole smoothie. Yeah. I need this smoothie to function. I need it for my body. You can enjoy it slowly. I'm not gonna take it. So you want one of these? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you sure? More than anything in the world. Okay, now if you want one of these, you're gonna have to talk to one of these. Holy s***, what the hell is that? No, Buddy, it's no, the same no. guy. Get it the f*** out of my house. Have you guys ever heard of the happy sandwich technique? Basically, you say something good first, then you deliver the bad news in the middle, and finally finish with something positive. This way, the negative point is cushioned by the happy bread. For example, if you wanted to tell someone their parents had died in a car accident, you'd say, Hey man, what a lovely sunny day. Your parents were crushed by a truck. I really like your sweater. That way, he'd be feeling so good about the weather and his outfit, he'd almost forget about the whole parents thing. Wanna hear a joke? No. Okay, here it goes. 500 bricks are on a plane. One falls off. How many are left? 
499. How do you put an elephant in a fridge? You can't fit an elephant in a fridge. You open the door, put the elephant in and close the door. <laughs> How do you put a giraffe in a fridge? Open the door, put the giraffe in and close the door. No, you open the door, take the elephant out and put the giraffe in and close the door. The Lion King is having a party. All the animals are there except one. Which one? Let me guess, the lion. No, the giraffe, because she's on the fridge. Sally has to get across a river full of alligators. They are very dangerous, but she swims across safely. How? She steps on the alligator's mouth. Nope, the alligators are at the party. But Sally dies anyway. How? She drowned it? No, she got hit in the head by a flying brick! Anyone want any muffins? I wouldn't eat those! Could be poisoned. What? Why would they be poisoned? I could ask you the same thing. Are you serious? Did anyone actually see him bake these muffins? Yeah. Did anyone actually see them bake these muffins? I didn't poison the muffins. Oh, and we're just supposed to trust you? Yes. Listen, eat them if you want. <laughs> But is it worth the risk? You just want more muffins for yourself. What? Are those crumbs on your top? No! Wait, you already had one? No! You already had one? I had three! And they were delicious! We did! Yeah! Dear Diary, I'm starting to think my housemate Tim can hear my thoughts. No, I can't. Dear Diary, I think Tim is really sexy. Oh shit. <laughs> Kill everyone in your family. Stab oh, them. Stab oh, oh, oh. them. I have a gun. I have missiles. I have a Death Star. I have your dog. I've got your dog. Oh, you want to be like that? I have your family. I have your browser history. Touche. Oh, thumbs up. Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh my god, it's starting. Yeah. The apocalypse already? Yeah. Where's my baseball bat? What? What were you doing in there? Just clearing my throat out. A demon? Having siblings is weird. I would take a bullet for them if. They asked me to hide a body, I'm hiding that body, no questions asked. If they need a kidney, I say which one? I don't need both. But there is no way I'm letting them borrow my charger. Hey, I'm borrowing your charger. Get the charger! Yeah, this shit good as fuck, bro. This shit great. Hey, I'm glad you like it, bro. Now we're gonna have you try the next sample. Okay. What's different with this one? This next sample is from a female cow. Then what was the first one? The first sample was from a male cow. Male cows don't produce milk. They don't even have udders. Yeah, bro. We uh, we already know that. What was in that cup? Trust me, bro. You don't, you don't want to know, bro. What was in that cup, bro? What did you make me drink? Let's continue with the next bro. one, bro. Forget about. Teacher, teacher. Yes. Would you punish me for something I didn't do? No. I didn't do my homework. <laughs> yeah, dude, it was hilarious. That shit kept going on for about like an hour until he Yo, bro, you good? Dude, I stayed up so late trying to finish that presentation for English. Oh, that one, yeah, that took me a while. How late did you stay up? I don't know, like 2.30? I got like four hours of sleep. Oh, yeah? <laughs> well, I got a grand total of two hours of sleep last night. That's... That's not good. Yeah, how the hell does that happen? Well, actually, I could have gone to sleep earlier, but I got bored and decided to watch Instagram Reels for four hours. That's really unhealthy. Yeah, dude, that's not a flat. Okay, I think I'll just set up over here. Grant! Oh, it's like, what? Can you explain to me why you have a 25 in English? No, no, I turned everything in. She just hasn't graded it yet, so it's marked as a zero. Oh, all right, that better be fixed soon, though. What was that all about? Were you arguing with your mom or no, something? No, I just have a 25% in English, but that's not my fault. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I have a 14% in English, and to top that off, all of my assignments are graded. How does that happen? That That's that's terrible. Wait, wait how'd you join the party? I'm really your son right there if you don't give me the password. D Dad? See, if you pull that trigger, right, then you'll wake up a version of me that you will not want to meet. I don't care. Dad! No, just wait. What are you... Are you sure you want to create a man who's got nothing to lose? Dad, what are you- Wait, are you just reading threatening quotes? Um, g God has- <clears throat> God has let me live another day, and I'll make it your problem.
All right, kid, I try my best. Tell him the password, you literal motherfucker! I'm so glad he bought us all three. Yeah, I did not expect him to buy all three of us. He must really like pumpkin. You know, I'm just grateful. We all got adopted. Oh, oh there he go, y'all. There he go. Hey there. How you doing? We was just talking about you. We just wanted to say thank you for buying all three of us. It's hard being a pumpkin out here. It yeah. is. It is. Mm -hmm. And I heard he, I heard him in the car. He said he gonna decorate us, child. Uh -huh. <laughs> decorate. Oh, yeah. I like that. Yeah, give me some Javachi or something. Yeah, mm -hmm. Honey. Yes, baby. I'm about to get the pumpkin in the middle and scramble the guts. Uh-oh. Girl. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad. Go ahead. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, come get this pumpkin pie. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. He picking me up, he girl. Give us a shot. So what you want me to do? You want me to roll over, bro? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, excuse me. What's the fastest way to the hospital? Close your eyes, cross the street. <laughs> Hello? Listen up. Tell him I said I am the man who stole your son. Uh, the name is Derek, or you can call me Pretty Princess, I don't care. And, and I'm the man asking you to please come get him. I'm coming home, I'm coming home. Kid, Tell just give me one second. I'm coming home. Here's something else. Stop it. I am blushing when you say that. Please stop touching me. You are fucking handcuffs. ridiculous. Do you know that? Oh my gosh, handcuffs? Tell me we're gonna use the handcuffs. Just sit down. You sit down beside me. You are leaving. Just relax. Fine, I'll go. I know, you're leaving. Sir, can you come get him? Yeah, I oh my gosh, not this song again. Stop touching me. Any last requests? No! Very well. Firing squad. Ready? Aim! Oh! Stampede! What? Bye! Ah, clever. Never mind. Bring me the brunette. I have nothing to say to you, you evil man. Fine. Firing squad. Ready. Aim. Look, tornado. What? Where? Ha! Bye. Ah, clever again. Okay, bring me the blonde. Oh, I get it. Distractions. Do you have any last requests? No, of course not. Very well. Firing squad. Ready. Aim. Fire! What are you doing? This is the pig I've been sleeping with. That's a duck. I wasn't talking to you. Okay, I'll be right back. You guys get to know each other. Sure. So, how'd you guys become friends? Oh, it's actually kind of weird, but... Is we... it the spiders? The spiders? He has more spiders in his house than average. <laughs> What's average? 38. I haven't seen any spiders. You're not looking hard enough. I'm not really looking at all. Good. Do you like there being a lot of spiders? Yeah. And I don't like sharing. Okay, I'm back. Sorry. Hope that wasn't awkward. It was pretty awkward. Why? What happened? He said he only hangs out with you because there's more spiders than average in your house. No, he said that! Why would I say that? I already have all the spiders I need. See, what does that mean? Okay, man, if you want my spiders, you could have them. I don't! He does! He said he already has all he needs. I do. Why does he want to certain them out? Oh, my mom's calling me right now. Hello? Where the fuck are you? Oh, I'm at my friend's house right now. Get your ass home now! Okay, okay, I'm coming home right now. Is that your mom? Yeah, bro. Tell her I said hi, bro. Oh, Ding said hi. Fuck Ding! Come home now! I'm beating that ass when you get home! Pick or beat! Trick or treat, he's got a speech impediment. Oh, and what have you come as? I'm a pirate. Pirate. Oh, and where are your buccaneers? My buccaneers are right here, why don't you use your bucking eyes? Oh! Relax. I just want to take some pictures. Hey, honey, look what I got for our son. You got him a phone? Hold on, let me get my camera out. But I got this for our son. I know, I want to record you giving it to him. Oh, I don't think you understand. I got this for our son. <gasps> this guy's driving around in the country, and he sees a sign that says Talking Dog for Sale. So he's a little intrigued. He pulls over, gets out of the car, knocks on the door. Farmer opens the door, lets him in. He walks up to the dog, he says, So, what have you done with your life? And the dog looks at him and says, Well, um, I worked in the Alps for a while, saving avalanche victims. I, uh did a tour of Iraq for my country, and now I just spend my days reading books to the elderly at a retirement home. 
The guy's amazed. He can't believe this. He runs up to the farmer. He goes, why would you sell a dog like this? And the farmer says, because he's a fucking liar. He's never done any of that shit. Fella gets into a fight with his wife. She kicks him out for the night. So he calls his buddy. His buddy says, yeah, come on over. You could stay with me for the night. So he goes to his buddy's house. They're sitting on the couch. They're having a beer. Guy says, all right, so tell me what happened. He goes, I, I don't know. One minute we're talking about the broken dishwasher, and the next minute she's calling me an arrogant, egotistical, chauvinistic pig. And his buddy says, all right, slow down. Tell me everything that happened from the beginning. He goes, I don't know. I walk in there. She gives me 1200 to buy a new dishwasher, and I hand the money back to her, and I say, you're hired. Do you want spicy? Boss, make me cry. You've been single for two years. Sexy Carmel? Who the fuck is this? Hello? Yo, what's good? Let me talk to Keisha. You wanna talk to Keisha? Bro, who's you? What you mean, who's me? I'm Tyrone. I'm Keisha's man. Keisha's man? Bro, I'm her husband. Husband? I've been with Keisha for like eight months, homie. What? That's my wife of five years, homie. Oh, hell nah. Yo, when you talk to Keisha, let her know I ain't paying half that rent no more. I ain't paying for that car note. I'm cutting the fucking Netflix off. And she can forget about that grocery money I've been giving her every week. Wait, you do all that shit? Yo, homie, I was just playing, man. I'm actually Keisha's cousin. So as soon as she gets back in, man, I'm gonna let her know you called, all right? Don't got me fucked up. We almost lost a good one.